Now, oxidative stress is essentially the aging of our cells, right? Um, and when there's oxidative stress in the body, what it essentially means is that your cells and your DNA are getting damaged more quickly, and this accelerates the aging process. Antioxidants are soaking up all of those damaging oxidative stress molecules um, so that they don't do that damage. Um, what's cool now, though, is that there's lots of things we can do to sort of sop up some of that oxidative stress and mitigate that. But if you're chronically stressed and in a mental state of fear, anxiety, just feeling like you're go, 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 and you're really tense, um, that is having downstream consequences for your metabolism, for your immune system, and for your hormones. And so realizing that, I find for my patients at least, can be really motivating to start to say, well, what are some of the things that I can do to reduce my stress level. When you start exercising regularly, when you're meditating regularly, when you're eating healthy foods, you feel better. And you also feel like you're more able to live the life that you want. And so the benefits aren't just this abstraction of maybe I'll live an extra year, 40 years from now. Right. It's about, wow, I feel really good right now and I'm actually able to make better decisions or I'm more in touch with what's meaningful to me and I'm able to figure out what I want to do with my life or I'm able to be a better parent. Um, so the work feels good and that's the piece that I think people miss. They sort of liken the work on eating differently as like a job and I'm like, no, you get to do this. How cool is that? And if we can find that enthusiasm, I think that can really help.